Exporting Schedule to Excel Spreadsheet. Here I have a door schedule. And if I want to export this out or dump this out into a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet, I can go up to my application menu where the big blue R is, hit the down arrow, come down to export, and then scroll down and scroll down till I get to reports. And I want to res uh, report out a schedule. So I click on schedule. It'll ask me where do I want to save this. So I got it in creating project details and schedules in that folder. I have my door schedule example and I'm going to save it as a TXT. Okay. So I'm going to hit save. That's fine with me. I like where it's at. I'm going to I'm okay with the file name, so I'll hit save. And then it comes up with export schedule. What do I want to include in the export? I can export the, the title, door schedule example, the column headers, sure. Include the group column headers, okay. I want to export the group headers, footers, and blank lines, sure, that's all right. And then the output objects, the field delimiter. How do we break up each piece of data? Do we break it up by a space, a tab, uh, a col uh, semicolon? or a comma and so I like tabs the best when we end up looking at it tabs will be orderly in a in a blank file in a generic file uh, it looks and easiest to read so I like that method the best and then uh, a text qualifier uh, we will put the little default um, quote mark here and then I'll say OK and I created that file. Now I'll go into my folders here and I'll go to uh, I'll go into my architectural drafting videos and I'll go into here and then scrolling down here here's my door uh, schedule file right here so you'll see I just click on just to give you a preview here that it kind of gives me a, a very generic type of way of formatting the text in which spreadsheets can read these really well. Um, so uh, basically they're formatted in tabs. They have the little quotes. Everything inside of a quote is the, the text data. So this is a case we want to use an Excel spreadsheet. We can get it out of a Revit and into an Excel spreadsheet for use to manipulate in that.